Welcome back, everybody. I'm doing these videos back to back because I have the time to and I want to finish this level. Last time you saw me do the two medical wings. Did today we get to go through the actual Okay, you're through. Itself. Should be clear from there to the morgue. Remember, the codes are on the captain's body. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan transmitting ship wide. We need more help. We don't have the resources to deal with this many cases. Nobody would tell us what's happening. These wounds. We are not equipped to deal with this. God. Get him to the table. Hold him. Nurse, you hold him down. Christ. Every quarter. That was Nicole, right? I can't tell from here when that log was made. I'm sure she's around here somewhere. Believe it or not, those books have significance. I do enjoy using it and it really does make short work of these little pricks. And if this isn't a little bit of foresight. I do believe you're able to 
get out other than here, but I'm not 100%. Anybody hear me? My name is Eileen Fisk. I just woke up in here and everybody was gone. I don't know what's happening. Why do they all leave? I'm going to try and find someone. If you can hear this, please come for me. I can hear scratching in the wall. Hello? Who's there? Are, are you a doctor? Why is everyone... Wait, I know you. You're Harris, the prisoner from the colony. You killed that nurse. Help! Somebody help me! Please! Please! If you would like to read it, just simply pause the video. Science Log Chief Science Officer Dr. Kine reporting. The colony's problems concern me greatly. I have no doubt they are somehow linked to the discovery of the marker, but the exact nature of that connection is still unknown. Almost 40% of the colonists are experiencing a form of dementia. The obvious symptoms are acute depression, insomnia, and hallucination. Incidents of violence and even murder also indicate extreme paranoia. Dr. Mercer has advised that I bring some of the affected on board for study. Dr. Wellen, the planet-side psychiatrist, has reported that his own analysis has been fruitless. I'm hesitant to rely on Dr. Mercer at this point, but I need his expertise. We need solutions. And we need them quickly. I do believe shooting them in the back that opens to produce those is also slightly a weak point. I could be wrong, I haven't tested it, but it more than just shooting them right in the face. Basically, the thing I despise about this room is what is 
about to happen. They are going to encounter And they look good. Thank God. I'll start accessing the captain's records right now. Head to the tram station, and I'll contact you there. I'm going to find out what the hell happened to this ship. One of them found a way down to the captain's nest. I managed to contain it in a damaged escape pod. Lifting executive lock down now. I found the deck logs. Whatever is happening around here, it came from the planet when they cracked it open. It spread to the colony and reached the ship. Isaac, this isn't an infection. It's some form of alien life. Shit, we've got bigger problems. The ship's engines are offline and our orbit is decaying. Get over to the engineering deck ASAP while I stay here and figure out what the problem is. And like most horror games go, there's more shit to deal with. Alright, so let's finish this up by going to the store. would buy a power node, but I'm gonna hold off on that, and I'm gonna actually purchase myself the line gun. Now this is the line gun. Essentially, as far as looks go, it looks similar to the plasma cutter, just on a bigger scale. As you can 
see it's got a wider spread too. It's secondary function. It's very, very deadly. Now everybody, this is the end of the level. Thank you for watching, and make sure you're writing down or keeping a log of every chapter's name. Like I said, there is an Easter egg in the name. And it was a very well thought out Easter egg too. Before I even start into engineering, I will cut it here and I will see you all later. Thank you for watching Dead Space. Have a good day.